As more pressure is put on every acre, whether it involves food, feed, turf, ornamentals, or even renewable energy sources, products must be developed to sustain those acres. SIPCAM ADVAN has the innovative chemistries to provide protection for these crops and meet the needs for sustainable and organic production practices. SIPCAM ADVAN's goal is to be a trusted and reliable supplier to distribution, offering profitable, innovative, differentiated solutions. SIPCAM ADVAN understands what it takes to achieve this. As a dynamic, innovative player in the world crop protection, chemical, and biofuel markets, SIPCAM ADVAN is dedicated to providing only the best chemistries and innovations to the market. At SIPCAM ADVAN, we recognize the potential of the biorational market. Our aim is to be a trusted and reliable supplier, bringing new products to market. We're very excited to be bringing three new biorationals to market in the next year. We recognize that the biorational market will give growers choice, both conventional and organic. The opportunity for organic food is huge. The organic food market is growing every year by over 20%. This year it will be valued at over $24 billion. SIPCAM ADVAN has three new products to detail. Contans, Actinogro, and Tenant. Contans is a product that is brought to the market for sclerotinium minor and sclerotinia sclerotiorum control, often called white mold in certain crops. Contans is very effective against sclerotinia sclerotiorum and sclerotinia minor in the soil. Here is a slide on Contans showing the infection rate on dry beans. The untreated portion is the orange, the one pound rate is the green, and the two pound rate is the yellow portion of the slide. This slide shows a one pound treatment on the right hand side that brought a 61 bushel per acre return on investment versus a 52 bushel untreated check. With a nine bushel yield increase and a ten dollar price per bushel of soybeans, this is equivalent to a ninety dollar gross return per acre. This slide is out of the University of Arizona where it's showing the number of healthy heads per plot. On the left hand side of the graph you have no inoculum and then the center of the graph has been inoculated with 100 milliliters of sclerotinia sclerotiorum. The right hand side of the graph has been inoculated with 1000 milliliters of sclerotiorum. As you can see on the right hand side of the graph there are different rates of different products. With a high level of infection on the right hand side of the graph both the 2 and 10 pound rate of contents showed the increased production of healthy heads per plot. Here is another slide out of the University of Arizona on Sclerotinia sclerotiorum on head lettuce. Once again, on the right hand side of the graph, we're taking this for the yield per plot on kilograms. Once again, the two and 10 pound rate of contents outperformed the competition. As you can see from this slide out of California, Sclerotinia minor drastically decreases per cc's of soil with a two and four pound rate versus the control and also Endura over time. Driven by this increasing consumer and food industry demand, the need for softer crop protection technologies will grow. SIPCAM ADVAN will support the traditional distribution channel by offering products that meet sustainable and organic criteria in addition to our differentiated and conventional crop protection products. SIPCAM ADVAN first introduced CONTANS to growers several years ago, an innovative fungicide that actually breaks the cycle of disease and promotes plant vitality in a variety of application environments. It's also been shown to control disease in both conventional and organic applications. Uh, our warehouse is located in Union City, Michigan. Uh, and we service a variety of crops, uh, specialty crops, seed corn, snap beans, uh, soybeans, corn, wheat, of course. Uh, and we also service quite a few tomatoes, uh, gladiolas, believe it or not. So we're quite diverse on the products we supply and the, and the uh, growers that we work with. We do offer some contract spraying. We also do some scouting, uh, but our main focus is delivering 
good products for our growers to work with uh, that enhance the profitability on their operation. We set out a couple of years ago to try and, and grow 100 bushel soybeans. Uh, in this neck of the woods, that's kind of a feat. The grower had been in a snap bean, soybean, seed corn uh, rotation. Uh, they just got to the point where they had so much white mold and other diseases. He uh, started working with us on the Contans product to try and knock the white mold down. You've got to think of it in terms of a living organism. It's got a shelf life that you want to pay attention to. Uh, and then the environment in which you spray it into, if you spray it into powder, I'll almost guarantee you a failure. But if you spray it onto a moist soil, cooler moist preferably, enough ahead of time, our success rate has been very, very good. Uh, I would rate our success rate this year in the high 90s, 96, 98 percent. Uh, maybe not 100, but certainly getting there. I farm with my one brother now, and it's a little over 6,000 acres. It's usually split between corn and beans. You know, we raise um, the edible kidneys, the white, the dark red, and the light red kidneys. And they're all processed locally here by Green Valley Bean. This is um, Park Rapids, Minnesota, more towards the um, northern part of the state of Minnesota. A little past, it's about 90 miles straight east of Fargo and probably 180 miles north of Minneapolis, St. Paul. We would split half a field on Catans and then no Catans so if we could see the difference between them and we could see the line where we were at even. You could see where the incorporator had made the loop and went back in and you could see the line where it got sprayed and went in. So there was a difference so that's what kind of made us a believer on that. 100 pounds of beans will pay for the cost of the product pretty easily so you know, with potatoes in the rotation, we feel that it is necessary to, to fight white mold. And that is probably one area that really takes your yield in a hurry. With seed being expensive and fertilizer expensive, it's just another cost to doing business. We're still a pretty strong believer in it. Hey, I'm Roger Gentz, uh, Golden View Farms at Menden, Michigan. We're in southwest lower Michigan. Uh, heavily irrigated, a lot of variety in crops. Uh, we raise about 1,800 acres of, of hybrid seed corn, uh, seed soybeans, and uh, just a wee little bit of wheat. We tried everything that we could think of. Uh, we've used all kinds of different sprays, and we're now concentrating mostly on trying, trying to work with contams. And uh, we say it's contains because it helps contain the problem. This is our third year with the product, I believe, and the second year on a large, fairly large scale and we've got a crop of soybeans behind us that's pretty growthy and uh, and it we're controlling the white mold quite well another new product that sipcam advan is bringing to the marketplace is a product called actinogro actinogro acts as a powerful disease management tool it provides a fast start for seedlings healthy crops and big yields Actinogrow protects seedlings and crops from attack by root rots and soil fungus. The product is active on Pythium, Phytophthora, Rhizoctonia, and Fusarium. The healthy treated roots aid water and nutrient uptake, thus providing a yield benefit. The product can easily be tank mixed with most chemicals. Another formulation of Actinogrow is the seed treatment portion. This controls damping off and root rot diseases. It gets seedlings off to a fast and healthy start. The active ingredient in Actinogro is Streptomyces lyticus. Actinogro controls soil-borne diseases and suppresses foliar diseases. It is labeled for both soil and foliar application while it controls damping off and root rot fungi. Actinogro has been documented to increase plant size, vigor, and root mass. It disarms defense mechanisms of fungal pathogens. It can be applied up to and including the day of harvest with no plant back, rotational crop or livestock feeding restrictions. Actinogro fits both conventional and organic use and it is an excellent IPM tool. This slide is showing Actinogro on soybean treatment in furrow and also at the R1 stage. As you can see from the slide, the untreated check yielded 53 bushels versus the treated check of 57. 
With an average yield increase of four bushels at $10 beans, this is a $40 gross return per acre. This slide is comparing Actinigro with Maxim MZ, also against an untreated check. On the left we have the total yield and then the second slide shows the amount of number one potatoes and the number two potatoes. Here is another slide showing Actinigro on corn out of Cedar Falls, Iowa. With a 12 bushel yield response and the price of corn being $4 per bushel, this gives a gross return of $48 per acre. Actinigro is a powerful and effective biofungicide that is labeled for all crops. The real innovation is the effectiveness that Actinigro has in protecting plants from root rot disease and promoting plant vitality in the seedlings, allowing them to more efficiently uptake water and nutrients. This increase in vitality translates to real yield increases across a broad spectrum of crop types, and Actinigro can be used in both conventional and organic operations.